Hello, I'm Lizzie and this is the gig economy in two minutes or less. The gig economy is just a hip name given to the destruction of the workforce since the global financial crisis. It's the fun label we give to cover up the harsh reality that full-time work is inaccessible and unsustainable for most young people who want to enter the workforce. The gig economy refers to the odd jobs that people do for extra cash outside of their everyday job and sometimes not related to the qualifications they've previously obtained. While freelancing is a really good foot in the door for people in artistic and creative industries like what I'm doing right now, there are some issues with the old side hustle. The advancement of technology and ever-growing presence of social media and apps in the work environment can be partly held responsible for the boom in side jobs. Uber, Deliveroo and Airtasker are all classic examples of jobs in the gig economy. It's unskilled labour without a strict schedule. But the problems with these flexible jobs is that they lack benefits like sick days, parental leave and other entitlements like on-the-job insurance. There's also no financial security when it comes to these jobs. Rather than being paid for your time, you're paid for the service you provide, no matter how long it takes. Some delivery riders in the UK reported earning less than four pounds per delivery. So while you might feel like a rock star for scoring the gig of delivering someone's food from two blocks away, maybe take a look at your workers' rights before signing up. That's the gig economy in two minutes or less. I hope you learned something.